The modern day equivalent of Jeff Duke is burly Yorkshireman David Jeffries. Just weeks before this program was completed, Big Dave raised the mountain circuit lap record to over 127 miles an hour. DJ first rode the TT in 1996 and took the Newcomers Award. After missing the 1997 races due to injury, he returned the following year to take fourth place in both the senior and production races. It was in 1999, however, that the wins started coming and it was very much third visit lucky for David as he joined the elite group of riders who had won three TT races in the same year. He took victory in the Formula One, production and senior events, as well as taking second place in the junior race to swell his TT earnings even further. Amazingly, 1999 was just the first in an unequaled hat-trick of TT hat-tricks for this latest TT hero who started the new millennium as he had finished the old. In the year 2000, Jeffries won the junior, production and senior races and made another big mark in the TT record books by posting the first ever lap at over 125 miles an hour. And when the TT returned in 2002, after the cancellation of the 2001 event due to the British foot and mouth epidemic, David was still on top form. Maximum Dave raised the lap record to over 127 miles an hour and took another hat-trick by winning the Formula One production and senior races. David Jeffries will not only be giving you his own insight on how to race the TT course, but he'll also be taking you on a wild open roads ride in our Mad Sunday segment. Well, I came over here in 96 and I went and did one lap on a bike and it was misty, so I didn't say after circuit anyway. Um, and then I thought, well, the problem with the place is that the corners that look like corners actually turn out to be three corners when you're doing them at 180 miles an hour and you just can't replicate that on the road. And I don't know, you learn it in sections. The bit from the sort of start to Union Mills or something like that. And then you'll sort of do Union Mills to Ballacrane traffic lights. Then you do the traffic lights to the start of Cronky Vody and you just, that sort of section. And each, it, but the thing is, every time you do a section, you get faster on that bit, the next section, you're suddenly approaching what you thought was a third gear corner, you're suddenly approaching it in fourth. So that's the next section's move. So every time you go a little bit quicker, you're learning all the time. I mean, I can sit now and just go through the, go through the place in my head. I mean, I actually, uh, we're actually in a pub a couple of weeks ago with some friends of mine and got in a rather embarrassing situation that I started talking a lap. And the embarrassing thing was it took me 35 minutes. <laughs> so I just hope that when I come and race it, I do it a little bit quicker than that. But no, I mean, I can do every bump, every gear change in my head now. So now I know the place like the back of my hand.